Touchscreen phones are the order of the day here at CES 2014. Right now, with another, and this is ZTE's Grand S2. This is a 5.5 inch display, 1080p phone. Uh, inside the uh, components are top of the line. We'll get into those in a second. But the big feature about this phone is its voice command uh, interface. So, uh, similar to Motorola's Moto X, you can actually wake up the phone when it's asleep. The, the phone's actually listening all the time, similar to, as I said, the Moto X. Uh, right now, this phone only understands Chinese, um, and I don't speak Chinese, so I can't open it. Um, but we'll just turn it back on real quick, um, and we'll long press. In addition to being able to open up, uh, or wake up the phone rather, you can also capture photos with your voice by saying something like, take a picture, say cheese, those three th uh, things. Uh, there's also a My Drive app, so that allows you to go in here and just use the phone just as you would with your voice to control it uh, so that when you're driving you don't have any issues with, you know, distracted driving or something along those lines. The interface to this is also very clean and the buttons are very large, so it'll be easy to do if you're behind the wheel and you have to reach over and press something. Inside, we have a Snapdragon 800 processor. We have two gigabytes of RAM. Uh, around back, we actually have a 13 megapixel camera um, and we have uh, up to uh, 30, 16 gigabytes of onboard storage uh, and there is actually additional uh, storage you can use via a micro SD card slot. Um, in addition to the cool voice feature, there's this little split screen application. So you can go down here, we'll take Chrome, we'll drag it up here, and we'll open it up again. We'll go down and we'll take this Dolby Audio app, which the phone also comes loaded with for good sound quality. And basically you can go between the two apps, similar to the multi-screen uh, mode uh, on the Galaxy S4 um, or uh, the uh, split screen mode on the LG G Flex. So uh, it's a great phone. There's an LTE radio built in, so that gives us hope that perhaps it may come to the US, although there are no announcements made for which uh, countries this will be available for. But again, this is the ZTE Grand S2. We're checking it out here at CES 2014, and I'm Dan Howley for Laptop Magazine.